Hello everybody, my name is Mitch. Welcome back to my single player. Mitch plays Minecraft, Mitchcraft World. And today, well, we had a nice little break last two episodes working on this neat little house out here. I really like it, especially the front porch area. This is really cool. I really enjoy this little part here and that walks up to here. And then we got another little subsection down there. A lot of little interesting parts to this. But now that we've had a little bit of a break, I want to go back over here to the Spike Dice Castle and get back to work on some of the interiors that we're missing just so we can say this project is finished. I mean, I don't know if we'll ever really finish finish it because there's always going to be something we can build around here. But for the most part, I just want to be able to find a place where I'm like, yeah, yeah, that's done. I think that's what I'm you know, kind of aiming for here. So I've got a little area planned out where we're going to do some building. I really like this place. This is really cool. Really epic feeling. It's just kind of got a big, like, kind of awe-inspiring moment, you know, walking into it. And that's what I want. You know, I want something interesting. Every little inch of this is interesting to look at. There's lots of detail, both big and small. There's just a lot going on here. I love it. Really love it. All right. So we're walking in here. I think this is the area. Do a full 360 here that we're going to work on today because it's kind of blah, kind of bare, kind of nothing going on here. Of course, we've got this area down here too that we need to do something with. All that we've got really built down here is where we were turning the concrete powder into dust. Yeah, or not into dust, ah, into solid blocks. Like the blue concrete powder gets turned into blue concrete because we can spam click it right here. But past that, we don't really have anything else planned here. So, hmm. I guess the first thing I've got to do is figure out all my entrances and exits here. This is a very busy hallway. With lots going on. Because they've got an entrance here. Entrance here. Then this hallway down to there. Hallway up to over here. There's a lot to figure out. So first, I guess let's just grab some blocks and figure out where our wall is going to be. One, two, three, four. Why do I have? I just randomly picked up bones. Throw that down there. Somewhat organized. I'm starting to end up with a lot of these little chests just laid out everywhere. Eh, not my favorite thing to have, but eventually I'll just run, run around the world, clean them all up, figure out, you know, where everything goes. So we've got this entrance here. This one kind of bumps right into it. Now we could kind of move that over one. Oh, this little hole here. I think, yeah, I filled that all in, but that's like right underneath the stairs. So if we needed that area, we could have it, but I don't know if we really need it or not. Because right now, sorry, I'm kind of scratching my head thinking about this. This walks into here. So it feels like we should at least have the hallway go to this point, right? And then that area back behind there will either be turned into extra storage or I don't know. Not a lot to be done there. We could bring this over like two, three, and then maybe kind of bend that around. Well, that just runs right into this. So let's bring this over that way. Oops, too much. Give me that back. Uh, that's kind of going to work. And that way we've got room to add details on these sides and these sides if we need to. Something like that. Yeah, I like that. So, yeah, let's get rid of these for now. We just got to figure out a basic framework for in here then let's see do we have much room to work with right here no that goes straight to outside Ugh. i want to give us some dimension to work with so i may cover that up temporarily just to uncover it later okay i think i feel like i've got a good flow going with the room so we got this you know entrance way here we might kind of round that off some Give a little more dimension. We got a hallway right there. We've got a hallway right here. 
and then stairs right there. And then I've decided to kind of make this into a little room for right now until we decide what else we're going to do with it. I don't know what we're going to do with that. I kind of want to use it and then I kind of just want to cover it up, pretend like it doesn't exist. But right now I was going to look at the ceiling. i got a very basic idea here that I want to go with. I'll see what this would look like if we just stretch these down both sides. Hopefully I've got enough wood to do this. I think I should. And give me that back. And we'll do the same thing on this side. Not exactly reinventing the wheel. And I'm not really worried about lighting just yet. But I think this will have a nice little, you know, it'll feel more like a hallway. Which is what we're going for. Medieval hallway. And then here we'll just add these to fill up and mainly cover up that glowstone from the sea or well the floor upstairs ceiling here smooth this all a little more out there there and hopefully it doesn't eh, no it doesn't create weird lighting effects yet at least okay let's look at this I like what we've got going on there. On this side, I feel like I should bring this down with something. Maybe bring these pillars down? Do we have room to do so? Yes. So if we pop this down, just kind of walk the, the pillar down from right there, and then do the same thing on this side. Give me that. Doop, 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 and doop. There we go. It's got a nice flow to it. Unfortunately, we've got an even number of things here, so I can't exactly like put something right in the middle. Same thing right here. Dang it. Maybe if I move this stairway, can I move this stairway over one? I mean, it's still gonna look a little awkward. We might just keep it like that. Now, do we want to do the same thing on this side? Can we, if we wanted to anyway? Ooh, yeah, we could. Now, I don't want to mix too much wood in here, but I think it helps to have the extra colors. And then I'm not exactly sure. Er, dang it. Give me that back. Not exactly sure what we're going to do with the floor either. Do that. Uh -huh. Yeah, this is starting to feel a lot more detailed. I like the ceiling. Next thing we got to figure out here is the floor. Now, I'm thinking about, you know, this is going to be kind of almost, you know, it's outside bottom level. It needs to have like a solid foundation to it. There's nothing else underneath here, at least not yet. So, you know, mixing some stone up with this feels like it would be a good thing to do. Let's just fill all this in with some stone, just to break up the floor pattern too. And then we might bring in some other blocks. I kind of wanted to see what this looked like first. Cause I don't mind if this is a little bit more messy because, you know, it's a ground floor. This is where like peasants and stuff hang out. This is not where your royalty is going to be sitting. I like that. That's got good levels of detail to it. Now, do we want to start mixing in like the cracked stone bricks, just occasionally. Like pop that one out, put it here. I think it makes sense to put it over here by the ice. A little bit of mossy. Oops, a little too much. Put that there, that there. Cause it makes sense that it'd be on that side cause there's like water right here. It might be melting into it. Then maybe do a little more cracked over here. Let's do like that. Oops, too much. Give me that back. There we go. Just little touches here and there. We want to work like cobblestone in anywhere. Like maybe we could like right here and like bend it around right there. I think all I've got are these slabs at the moment, but that'll work. Oh, yes. Maybe another 
That's not going to be too much the same, is it? Put that there. I like it. I think I do like it. Let's hit the F3 button. How are we doing on lighting? 10, 9, 10, 9, 10, 9, 8. Right here. I'm not seeing the 7. I don't think any mobs can spawn right there. I may still do something about lighting right there. I mean, I could end up putting a glowstone. Maybe like cover it up with a trapdoor in the middle there. Or we could just add another. Oh, let's hit F3 again. So that can be too much torch. So I kind of got the torches on the sides here. I don't know if I really like it right there. Hmm. Now I'd like to have something more interesting happening right here. What if we pop out some of the blocks? If we do something like that, can we create an interesting like pattern or arch right here? Not really, because it's all the same on the left, but not on the right. Err. What about that block? Nope. That block's not going to work for me either. I don't think. Hmm. I'll put something like that there. Then maybe... I don't know. This may just have to be something we sit here and play around with until well, I get something I'm happy to look at. I just want something different going on on that wall. It's too samey samey, too matchy matchy. And then something with these walls here. I'm thinking like right here we could do upside down stairs just to kind of give it the concave feeling of you're walking into a different room if you go this way. This room ceiling is probably going to be covered up too so I don't mind that that kind of sticks out right now. Let's go ahead and try that out. Oh, I've got these cyan terracotta too. What if we mix that in with the back wall? I'm getting too sidetracked at the moment. Um, I don't have any stairs. Can we make some stairs? Doop. That'd probably be enough, right? I like that that doesn't just throw things on the ground anymore. That's a very nice update. Very nice new feature. See, that's what I'm thinking. That looks nice. That looks nice over here. Let's try it over there. Yeah. That's got a good flow to it. Maybe if we add in... Is that going to feel weird if it's flush up against the wall? Not really. I don't mind it. Hmm. Maybe we play around with it and see. I've got to fix these stairs. This is just going to bug me until it's done. Let's just put this in here. Do, 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 do. And then just move these from the side. Bloop, bloop, and bloop. Uh oh, a little too much blooping. It's okay. Now I'll put this here. There. Now that matches up again. And it won't bug me, thinking that, oh no, you're going to fall off. Of course, we got to figure out how we're going to walk into this room, too. This room's kind of become a mess now. So I was thinking about having, like, a big, like, thing in the way here to kind of lead you around a corner. But now I don't know. Hmm. Let's get rid of these for the time being. I'm not entirely sure that's what I'm going to do. Give me that. That kind of opens this back up again. And then... I don't think, uh-oh, that's why I had that there. Any redstone drop? Of course redstone dropped. <sighs> okay, well that's why that was like that then. I thought I had it figured out. I'll fix that later. Hmm. I guess we could just bring the wall in right here. See, I thought that I was just trying to be fancy with my designing. Unfortunately, Looks like we're going to have to have it that way. 
And then what if we bring this wall up here? Like that. I know, I'm getting a little bit sidetracked, but I want to figure this out while I've got everything here. That's going to walk that down there. Well, it's going to be a three-way there. Two-way on that side. Because I don't think there's any way to bring this back. If I could bring that back to here, that would be perfect. Hmm. I may have to figure out the layout of that room another time. Right now, I want to kind of get this all finished up. Had this room here. I just thought we'd just throw down a little bit more storage in here, just in case. You can never have enough chests, right? Right. And I know I said the whole thing about having the floor solid and stone, but I want to break it up some. Maybe there was a big hole here and they had to cover it up with wood. I know, I'm messing up with my previous backstory to why the floor is the way it is. But that's okay. I can do that. Then here, I just want to drop this down, a little cobble pillar. Because we've done that in various places in here too, so it kind of carries that design idea along. Yeah, that looks that looks good. Nice little cool storage room. What's the lighting like in this corner? This feels dark. Hey, it's eight. Eight, nine, eight. Hmm. I guess if we wanted to, we could bring, well, I don't know. I'm going to bring another column up right here. Because I kind of had this one here because it kind of evened this out on this side. And that's an outside wall. Can't mess with that. This wall's even here. But that's not going to exactly make an even area right there. Do to do. -do. Let's play around with it at least. Do I have any more? Yeah, there it is. We bring that up here. So much room, or so much time spent on a storage room I may not ever use. Oh, got my axe put up. Okay, there we go. There. That's going to be a little off-center on this side. Does that bother us? I don't think so. Still creates an interesting space because of the floor layout. We may even bring in a couple of pillars of, or not pillars, but planks of the darker wood. Of course, I'm going to have to get my axe back. We just did that in a couple of spaces in here. Maybe bring it all the way back there. Then maybe right here in this corner. That floor is just getting a little boring to me. I don't know. Sometimes boring floors are good. Other times, not so much. Walk through here. Just adding in all the details. Lots of tiny details today. Think that's good though. Oh, I kind of messed that up though. Um. Ugh. Do we just turn that entirely into a cobble wall? Can we do that? We have the technology. I would like to use this, but it's not going to equal or frame up correctly anyway, so blah. Hmm. But yeah, let's just cover it up. We could have a little window in the middle. Yeah. That is kind of cool looking. Why not? Let's be wacky. Put that there. Drop that all the way up to here. It needs something on the top and bottom. So let's just go with slabs for now. Can I see that? I can't see that. Can I see that? I can see that. Ha ha! There we go. Okay. Hmm. I think that's probably going to be it for today. Hope you've enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. And I will see you guys again 
next time.